What's up, everybody? Potato Man here. Welcome back to Phantom Liberty. Attention, all Dark Town residents. This is Kurt Hansen. We've got some important guests in Dark Town. Here by my personal invitation. Stay down. <laughs> someone like you end up here my owner bought me from some junk dealers revamped reprogrammed and finally infused me with her spirit gape earth and this unhappy wretch in tomb or change my form whence all my sorrows come the tree still planted in the unfinished part not wholly vegetative and heaved her heart your programming sounds ancient what can I get you? Nothing right now, sweet pea. What do I say? I don't know, what do you say? It was not like seven vehicles left we have. We have like seven vehicles left or something. <laughs> oh god. Excuse me. Been here before, Reed. Exactly like right then. Remember the last time we had this convo? Ah, V, you're here. Damn. About time too. Nearly done finalizing the plan. I could have, I should have stayed behind and let you guys finish what you were saying. Kind of interested. Back on the same page, are we? Not exactly. Brings back a lot of memories. All this. One in particular sticks out. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. What happened in Medellin? What was the op there? We had our sights trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp tech. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's... A long story. I think we can spare 60 seconds. Hell, might even learn something about so me that'll prove useful. All right. Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aim to plant our own SA in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to walk his Doberman. Spending big money on Kit's luxury was kind of his M.O. So what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, <laughs> shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, Who's a good boy? Then she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. B 
Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of her spine. Worked out though, right? We're all here, now, together. Hmm. Which can't be said for Hernandez and his men. We took any possibility of that from them. All thought of subterfuge went poof. We had to kick the door down. A rival cartel wiped them out. That was the official version. Okay, back to Night City, folks. With our sights trained on a new target. Ooh. Huh. Interesting. Activity coordinates added to the map. Wait, what? Oh. Okay. I never knew that those were still a thing. Valuable items. Okay. A lot of NCPD scanners left. Auto fire, Jesus. We parsed the intel from the shard Somi gave us. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here is your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. No, she was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Stop worrying, Reed. We'll get her out. Save her. I know. And not just her. Ladder goes for you, too. Right. Our objective. Free showed me from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue op. Because, well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall, a consequence of her service to the NUS and President Myers. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech wise and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, it'll kill her. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint US Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Osaka soul killer. The matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the black wall and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. All right, plan, let me hear it. Hanson and me with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. 
They know it's security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hansen access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hansen's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals, we have. Now, we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Emmerich and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand? Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. Yeah, I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, cause they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hansen. So we kidnap them. How we wanna do this? They're driving a rental while in NC. An exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it. Before they reach Hansen at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavior imprints are tuned already. And you're rolling all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil wrap. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem-free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hansen. Right. Where you'll sell them the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Hansen and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress-up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird? We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much herself. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. First step, what was it again? Securing a trace on the Netrunner's car. This bit's on you. Alex will expand on that in a minute. Meanwhile, we'll make sure the personality data and imprints are airtight. Main goal, want to make sure I'm clear. We're springing Songbird free from Hansen's iron grip and seasoned tech that's gonna save your lives. You and Alex enter the stadium as Hansen's visiting Netrunners. Disguise is our key to the op. How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. Sir. So, time we talk nabbing the runners? Cover that in a minute. And any for your thoughts, Alex, about all this? Honestly, still wondering why neither of us went back to DC. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep, saddle you with a Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something, like the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. Myers doesn't know the deeds of this op, does she? Never will, is that right? It's not wrong. So we serve Hansen up on a silver platter, and be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways, we're royally fucked. Welcome to the agency. 
You know Wee better than I do. Wee thinks. What's his true aim here? Saving so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her. Always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality. Life. With mixed results, mind you. Hmm. And so me? Same story as always. Dares, lands neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those, we find the car easy. There's a station not far, near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. The stations, how do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. Find it hard to believe taking one station will be enough. Rental agencies got rare rides to protect. Hmm. See if I can find more info. If the one's not enough, we'll improvise. So, breach the station, trace the car. Good. What then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Dunno. Anything goes wrong, I'll be stuck in there. Suck it up. This is FIA trunk ops, soldier. <laughs> Seriously, though, the tech just works. And we'll have your back the whole way. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it.
Damn. Oh yeah. Oh wait, no, that's right. I think we tried to do that last night, but it... Yeah, I was gonna say, we tried to do that last night, but the, uh, the door wouldn't open, so we're gonna have to try that some other time. talk long but two things quickly first good news i managed to upgrade your relics firmware you'll see what i mean in a minute don't worry completely painless relic upgraded how'd you manage it no easy feat i guess we can take that advanced mm, let's say i've had extra time on my hands more than i expected don't worry we're getting you out of there i know 
first good news, you said. Isn't there a second thing? Right. It's super important. It stays between us. It's gotta. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay. okay. Need to Delta. We'll see you soon. Between 11 and 1 a.m. 11 p.m. and 1 a.m. It is 12.30 so it could work. Ah! 
have gotten <clears throat> far. Surprises. No surprises. Except maybe you're already one of us. Don't trust a soul. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. 
Wanted to show you something. Means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Oh. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasting funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scoff dogs around. He shit talking one of his tunes. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Yearning to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you missed something, it's usually too late. The way she's talking about that reminds me of Down Home too. See, I'm I'm from the country, so like all those bonfires and all the all the like fun camaraderie and all the fun fun ruckus. Very familiar, very homey. Attack on Myers. You schemed it up with Hansen. I know that. Yeah, Neural Matrix was pricey. But honestly, I... I never thought he'd try to kill her. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself too, almost. 